The Demon of the Gibbet, written by Fitzjames O'Brien, read for you by Edward E. French. There was no west, there was no east, no star abroad for eyes to see, and Norman spurred his jaded beast hard by the terrible gallows tree. O oh, Norman, haste across this waste, for something seems to follow me. Cheer up, dear Maud, for thanked be God, we nigh have passed the gallows tree. He kissed her lip, then spur and whip, and fast they fled across the lee. But vain the heel and rowel steel, for something leaped from the gallows tree. Give me your cloak, your knightly cloak that wrapped you oft beyond the sea. The wind is bold, my bones are old, and I am cold on the gallows tree. Oh, holy God, oh, dearest Maud, quick, quick, some prayers. The best that be, a bony hand my neck has spanned and tears my knightly cloak from me. Give me your wine. The red, red wine that in the flask hangs by your knee. Ten summers burst on me accursed, and I'm athirst on the gallows tree. O oh, Maud, my life, my loving wife, have you no prayer to set us free? My belt unclasps, a demon grasps, and drags my wine flask from my knee. Give me your bride, your bride. <laughs> Bonnie bride that left her nest with you to flee. Oh, she hath flown to be my own, for I'm alone on the gallows tree. Cling closer, Maud, and trust in God. Cling close. Heaven, she slips from me. A prayer, a groan. And he alone rode on that night from the gallows tree.